What up guys, Nathan from Blast Camp, number 53. Jackson Frey, number 12. From Blast Camp, you know what I mean? Here walking the Texas, is it Lone Star Open? Yeah, the Lone Star Open. And uh, You're my yeah. favorite bench warmer right here. Just wanna put that out there. <laughs> this guy, <laughs> one event, one event. Uh, first impressions. First impressions, hmm. That side's wide open, the Dorito side. Yeah. There's some big gaps, especially if you come out here to this can or even this temple, like you, this tall temple, you come here, dude. Look at these gaps right here. This is big. Shit. Hmm. Yeah, even yeah, from this some... can. What's that? Even from this can, this can doesn't stop much. I feel like you could just go low and crawl and you'll make it to like their Dorito. But that tower pretty much stops everything. The question is, do we think we can make it out here off the break consistently, though? That's um, the question. I mean, look at that, dude. Look at the home. Shoots this all day. The amount of bunkers that, like, aren't on this side, I feel like three grids worth, like, 30 feet. It's a lot of space. That is a lot of fucking space. <coughs> all right, let's see what we got here. This guy can shoot on the inside and see the gap into the snake, but that's about it. Yeah, and the you can fight the tower and the delta, the tower and the can, and then that's about it. Obviously yeah. the middle. This reminds me of like watching old school paintball with like giant gaps everywhere. This is a lot of fucking gaps. I like it, Picasso. What are you thinking, Jax? Uh, there's a lot of space over here, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. It's really just the tower and the can, and then once you get to this little Dorito, then it's that tower. Yeah, this is where it really slows down right here. I guess meanwhile the whole time that uh, left side wedge can shoot you as well. Yeah. But like, if you just go low, then the can's not gonna shoot you at all. If you go low anywhere. Yeah, but there's still now it's the back five, side. six, seven different bunkers right here that can shoot it. I'm looking at four people that can shoot me right now. Plus the two in the middle, so six. Yeah, because they're not gonna play over there. They're not gonna play cross all the way in that corner. Plus this dude in the, someone's wait right there waiting on you. Oh yeah. In the right wedge. But like, I don't know, hmm. there's a lot of people that can see this. Yeah, the snake side's gonna be faster. I think. But if those guys aren't ready on the cross, I mean, you go low and it's just the tower. Yeah. I mean, after you get past the delta, the big thing is probably gonna be getting out of the delta. Cause some dude could probably even go here that you don't see and then he just sits right here and then you think you put the tower in and then he's just sitting right here. Or no, you could even be right here. Nah, eh, no you can't. That's a pretty small gap. Is it? Uh, if you're not over the top, you can't really see it. Yeah, no, you have to be over the top. But he could go over here and then jump on over the beam and then he's in your brick and then now we're all screwed. This is a Drew job. Drew or soap. I mean, if people are going short, I mean, this is probably wide open. To I mean, if you here. miss, if you miss him going from the can to the Dorito from here or there, you're not playing. Yeah, put him on the bench with Fired. you, brother. <laughs> Let's check this brick. I thought that was funny, Nate. I thought that was a good one. Snake side, shall we? Yeah, snake side. I was looking at this. This guy definitely shoots the snake better than a lot of people. But you gotta kinda like, be like right here in this line. Let's see. Can this? You probably get a good shot on the corner from here. My bad. I mean, you can, I mean, essentially you can shoot the snake guy too from here. Yeah. It's the same lane. 
Dorito sides got the shot on the D1. Say again? Uh, you got the shot on the D1, but that's the same shot as this, which this gap is huge. Two gaps, really. Yeah, but I mean, after that can, I mean, that's what, 15 feet at least? So like this can shoot it pretty well. Like maybe you come back here and you delay right here. You don't think the back center is gonna shoot you? That's why I'm kind of like blinding myself out. Preferably you don't stand in a spot where you can see you. Well, yeah, but. Or you run up to that, or you just gotta come right here and just shoot like straight over the snake beam. I think his first couple of balls are gonna be right here though. And then yeah, might I would be, agree. yeah. That's why maybe you just run up to it and then shoot, like pull your gun up. If you run around, even if you run like up to the middle or anything, like you can't see it. Yeah, no. I mean, even if you run straight at this brick, you can't see it. That brick really sucks. You said it sucks? Yeah, you can't really see anything. I mean, yeah, you can just wait on him in the 50s. You can come right here and Yeah, you just wait for him to poke his head up. Other than, I mean, it's pretty defensive, I'll say that. I don't like that. I mean, I don't think we'll stop right here, ever. If you get up here, you might as well either go here or here. But yeah, you're leaving that bunker because that bunker sucks, dude. I mean, dude, if you get here, you can shut this whole side of the field down, have the one guy trying to attack, and then have everybody else focus that way. Just got to make sure you don't get bunked. Yeah. People are probably going to be crawling and then, like, shooting. If they know you're right here, they're probably just going to go to the other one and then, like, try to shoot you in the pack. Yeah. I mean, I'm aiming for heads, not packs, brother. Whatever it is, that girl can spend on me. This doesn't even have that good of a cross over here. I mean, yeah, like the 50 Dorito, but. It's a pretty good shot. You got think the left thing, you're the snake too. I want to be looking at you to go. Looking at me? Yeah, I'd be looking at you. Hey, man, you better, you better back off my boy. Just come. It's probably a good spot to go once you bunker people, though. Like, you come along on this side, then you just dive into here. Yeah. You can shoot any of these guys. If they're not in the Unless snake. Unless he's laying down. <laughs> if they're not he could the be laying too, down right there. And then, well, yeah, if they're in the snake, then your back is blown to bits. Play it as tight as you can without moving the bunker, right? Maybe you could take this off the break. If you come around here, if they're not in one of those bunkers, and one of those bunkers isn't shooting cross, you just... Get some speed. I'm not doing it. No, I'm just kidding. I think that's more of a Kyle thing. I'll do it. Fuck it. You see what I'm saying, though? No, I, I know exactly. If someone what you're isn't shooting this gap right here. I see you. I see you. Yeah, I see we got to make sure we shoot the snake guy then, because. Well, none of those guys will probably look cross. I mean, there's no cross shot for anything over here. Hey, what is this? Why is this on the field? Could have got hurt, bro. You're right. Hey, you see what happens when E Man helps me set up the field? He found a stake too, so that's double blame on E-Man. So then this is the corner. I was looking at this too. It's like, yeah, this corner can't really see the wire, but maybe can't you can't see like the wire at all. Take a step out. If you put ooh, the ooh, if you put the tower ooh. in. You have to come out pretty damn far to see the wire. Well yeah, dude, risk. High risk, high reward. How else are you gonna shoot the snake? In the snake? By not looking at him? Get in the snake? Yeah. That's probably <laughs> what I would do after I shoot the guy. I'll just get in there and go get close to him and then stab him. Three to one's dead. Probably a bounce shot off That's that can or something into the Dorito. No. Nah. I'm gonna shoot it. You go right ahead, brother. All right, let's see inside here. You can shoot the can, the tower. Go close inside, the other tower. Hmm. It's really just this wedge right here, huh? What? That can see you? Hmm. If you go low.
Yeah, I mean, realistically, it is only the wedge. If you get to if you get to this snake right here, they shouldn't be able to live in the middle at all. They're gonna have to play the snake beam. I mean, even better, you just oh, hits the camera. You just get right here. You're gonna see people just going. They could live on the left side of that diamond if you're right here, though. But you shoot everybody from right here. Their snake too. Good player. Yeah, good players are just gonna come straight down this snake. They may live in the tower because of that Aztec, but like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. They're all dead. The only people you don't shoot is the corner. Interesting. Shall we? We shall. Have we not walked anything yet? Hmm. Pretty much everything. So what are you guys' first impressions of the field then? Um, the reader side seems pretty slow. Wide gaps, lots of gaps. Uh, that tower pretty much locks down. If you have someone good in that tower that can gunfight and lock down a zone, they probably should have uh, a hard time coming down that side. This. It'll be interesting to see if you can run Snake off the break, because then it comes down to just like a gunfight on the wire. And the middle seems like it should be pretty easy to get up to, but once you get up there, there's probably gonna be someone else, so it's probably gonna be mind games. And if you're gonna be bluff and blow spot, up you gotta there. go to the other, shoot them. Really just people trading out up there, I would see. Probably a lot of rundowns, like with people going into these mini Ws too. So overall prediction, fast, slow layout, what do you think? I'd say it's gonna be a quick one. I would say if people one. make the snake, this could be pretty fast. If they can make the snake. If they can't make the snake, and everybody's just trading out in the center and playing the pocket, probably gonna be pretty slow. I don't really see it being fast on the Dorito side with that many gaps. I don't gaps. see it either. Because one person could just hold down that whole Dorito side from the tower. And, and on top of it, over there, there's like, like from right here to come to our side of the field, there's like, I mean, that's almost as big as the gap. From I mean, the just tower. look at it. <laughs> it's, it's huge. But it'll be interesting because like if someone crawls all the way down the snake and is in your snake and shoots two or three people, then yeah, you should be able to just fly down that snake. Everyone's going to be looking at this guy. So yeah, probably a lot of counter punch. I mean, if you can, if you can get out on the Dorito side, you can get to like the second or third Dorito, and then there's a lot of shit that can just shoot you. I mean, I don't really see it being slow in the back, but once you get to like the 30 yard line, then it gets slow, you know? That's if you can get out yeah. there. True. Hmm. You know? I kinda wanna play the snake. Hmm. That's what they all say. Everybody wants to be a snake god. Well, we got enough people here. Should we get some 515s going? Yeah, let's do That's it. That's what I'm saying, dude. You're fucking holding me up, dude. Yeah.
Thanks for killing me! Hey! hey. Why is your cost to play? Okay, you guys got to fucking go to work. Hey, Dorito 1! Dorito 1! Dorito 1, Snake 2! Dude, what is stopping you guys right now? Snake 2! Why? You're right, you're right, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Jackson, Kyle, it's Big Echo. Why are we not just crawling down the snake? You guys gotta correct that. If I know that, and I know there's three my way, huh? No, that means Big Echo. There's nobody past the Echo. Okay. I gotta know that. But I, also, I didn't know. No, I didn't yeah. know where you guys. I also don't think it was actually Big Echo. No. I think he was in the snake for a while. Uh, so the dude, I'm heads up. It's Big Echo for sure off the break. I'm heads up. E-Man, we're in the Lucy. E-Man comes around and trades with him. I rap, and then I look back. He was dead, and I think that's had to have been when he went to the snake, because he never engaged me after that. So I think that's when he went to the snake, and then from there, I looked over and he was sliding into the 200, and then he shot me in the face. Are you guys good to go again? I thought someone said kill two, and I think, I think you said 200. Yeah, my last words were 200, and then got crushed. Hey, Tittle! Were you shooting at me going to the can? Hey, your paint is there. Keep it where it's at. What? Your paint's there. Keep it where it's at. You just barely missed me.
Enemy kill three! That goes on me, kill. Kill the hole! Hey. I think kill five! Caleb, why don't you come to this wing? Go!
Hey, nice dive, man. That was good. Just keep them feet down. You guys ready? We're good. Game in five! Go!